people will buy it. Yeah. And of course, people do love their cars here in West New York because we're, we're a city of drivers. There's no doubt about it. And look at the professionals that we met yesterday, the, 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 the gang of about 300 uh, talented professionals who work on these domestic cars and are very, very proud when these cars come out on the showroom. Well, I mean, Buffalo is an automotive town, mm -hmm. and we talk about the dealership base, but when you think of the stamping plan, the engine plan, the axle plan that used to be here, the Lockport, it's special yeah. to have a show in our town that can reward the legacy of those people who worked here. Yeah. Now, Paul, let's also remember that this all started off with a wonderful charity extravaganza on Wednesday night, and that was just a wonderful thing for the Punt, uh, the Pass and Punt Foundation, the Brian Mormon Foundation, and uh, oh, Joe DeMarco we spoke to from Wings of Flight. These folks can't do what they do without that money from the uh, NFADA, these great dealers, and all the money that comes in charity-wise for this. You know, Linda, we talk about the big groups, and those are all worthy, but this, you know, you look at Save the Michaels and the Teacher's Pet. Right. Those things, you know, you give them a few grand, and it, and it just yep. magnifies into so much positive yep. for students and, and people in need. So it's not always that 100000 or half a million dollars. Right. It's the five and ten that probably make more difference when our donation to some of these people because sure. they've never had it. That's right. So listen, everybody, when you come on in, and the doors will open at 11 o'clock, I want to remind you, I think we've got uh, this separated into two floors. We are upstairs. What's downstairs? Uh, about the same kind of excitement as upstairs. More of the Highline cars, mm -hmm. probably more of the exotics, more of the intimate. When you get in a ballroom, you're looking at a ballroom type car, mm -hmm. not, not a work truck. Right. So some of the imports are downstairs too. Yeah, many yeah. of many of the Highlines, right. the Lexus, the BMW, the Mercedes, the Alpha, you know, the Audi. So th that's the area where people like to gravitate and fantasize. Oh yeah. Well, again, we are going to remind everybody that tomorrow, especially, is for the kids. So check your schedule about all the events that are supposed to be happening for tomorrow. Courtney Corbetta is with us. She has been so busy working here at this uh, auto show. Courtney, you've introduced us to a lot of women who are really making their mark in the local auto industry. That's right. And good morning. Good morning to the both of you. Paul, good to see you again. Thank you. Thanks yes. for coming back. Yes. Well, as the auto industry continues to grow, I found that it's the women who fuel the industry right here in Western New York. And throughout today's show, we're going to introduce you to some women of influence in the auto industry. One local woman who enjoys giving back and helping her employees reach their fullest potential. An act of kindness that helped her years ago. Take a look. Beth Ann Hollis started working in the auto industry when she was just a kid. My story is not as glamorous maybe as some, so I got into the industry because I was a young single mom um, and I needed to make a, a good income. And after 17 years with West Her Auto Group, some things never change. I love helping employees reach their potential. I love seeing what someone did for me back when I was 19, 20 years old, seeing that someone has a lot of potential and actually helping them to fulfill their own aspirations. It's a pretty rewarding thing to do. The director of variable operations takes pride in her position. There's not a lot of careers that what you what you put in, you will get back out. And her hard work hasn't gone unnoticed. Hollis recently received the Buffalo Business First Women of Influence Award. I don't like a lot of fanfare, but it was a really humbling experience and an honor that the people I work with and the people I work for felt I was even worthy of the nomination. She now feels that she has a responsibility to promote and keep women moving forward. I felt like, oh, this is encouraging me to take it to that next level. You know, how do I go out and, and get more women to take opportunities in our industry where they too can be a woman of influence? Empowering women throughout Western New York. I'm excited about what's happening right now, the voice that women have in today's business world, I really am. And I feel for myself, um, anytime, anytime I might have hesitated because of being a female, I feel like I've been in an environment in this company where I had the confidence to just, to just keep pushing forward, pushing forward. Courtney Corbetta, AM Buffalo.
Linda's Hairstyles, courtesy of our salon. Make our salon your salon. Transit Road, Williamsville. And our beautiful flowers are brought to us weekly from Buffalo's Best Flowers. Maybe looking outside and seeing all this snow, this is appealing to you to have a little bit of spring brought right to your house. So give them a call or log right on to buffalosbestflowers.com. Well, we are here at the 2018 Buffalo Auto Show where everybody is coming down to take a look at these gorgeous cars. And we want to invite you too because up for grabs right now, a pair of tickets to this great show, which lasts through the weekend. So if you'd like to win these tickets, you'll be caller 7 right now at 644-9840. And if you are caller seven, those tickets are yours if you have not won anything from us in the past 90 days. So while you're busy doing that, let me also tell you that some kids in this area start to get their automotive education as early as in high school. Eyewitness News reporter Liz Lewin has more on this story. Success looks different for everyone. Maybe it's a bachelor's degree or maybe it's trading in a textbook for some real life experience. Sometimes that's what kids need. They just need to go right into it. When you get into the real workforce, it's not all the time of what's in a book. Sometimes it's different and how you have to deal with people. Alex Prims and Kyle Huttenmeyer are seniors in Erie One Bosi's Auto Tech Training Program in Kenton. This duo knows more about cars than your average person does. They're winners of the 2018 Ron Smith Memorial Auto Tech Competition and are headed to New York City to compete at a national level. An opportunity they say would never have been possible without their teacher and programs like this one. It's just a good feeling knowing that you know, there's work out there. We don't have to worry for the rest of our lives that there's always cars to be fixed. There's always work to be done. John Gorman graduated from the same program back in 2002. At 17, Gorman signed a contract at Paddock Chevrolet and is now their lead technician. People that have let the industry pass them by, they don't want them anymore. They want these kids. With demand for tradespeople increasing, jobs are only waiting. They didn't graduate with any debt. And when you evaluate where they are economically, within a matter of years, they're set for life.
Welcome back everybody to the 2018 Buffalo Auto Show. Well, we're just getting started and there's so much going on here. There's going to be a full weekend of fun events and things to do. But did you know that more women than ever are working in the auto industry? And that means here locally too. They continue to change the public's perception of the business. Well, meet Tammy Severino. This woman of influence is making a difference at Keller Chevrolet in Chictawaga. Take a look. Go ahead and open up the hood. And Tammy Severino isn't afraid of getting her hands dirty. She grew up in the auto industry. Thank you so much. When I started, I was, I was a kid. I had no idea what direction I was going in life. And it started as a job. Never in a million years did I would think that it would be a career. And what a career it has turned out to be. 37 years later, she's now the service manager for Keller Chevrolet in Chictawaga. But it's much more than repairing vehicles. First and foremost, our customers are the most important thing. Next comes... Female-friendly environment here, that's the second thing. Stop by the dealership on any Tuesday for Ladies' Day. For every woman who walks in the door, money is donated to the Family Justice Center of Erie County. It's women helping women just for walking in the door. And the support doesn't end there. Severino makes it her duty to help other women. I want to have my customers be as educated as they possibly can be because as we know as females, knowledge is power. She's proud of her position and can't imagine doing anything else. It's enabled me to show my children that women can do whatever they want. Um, and I think I've raised a couple of really great kids by showing them that you can have it all. Courtney Corbetta, AM Buffalo. AM Buffalo Furnishings provided by Bassett Furniture. Visit their showroom online at BassettFurniture.com. One of the biggest challenges that many of us face is how to satisfy our sweet tooth while staying on track. If you're like me and try to totally cut sweets out of your diet, you'll probably end up cheating after a short while. A better option, use moderation and cut back on sugar and fat as much as possible. Let me show you a to die for version of tiramisu that does just that. We start by lining the bottom of an eight inch square baking dish with ladyfingers and drizzling them with some strong black coffee. 
On top of that goes a layer of sugar-free instant vanilla pudding mixed with some fat-free cream cheese and a little bit more coffee. More lady fingers go on top and we finish it with some fat-free whipped topping and a dusting of cocoa powder. A few hours in the fridge and done. This recipe is actually from our friends at EverydayDiabeticRecipes.com. Yes, it still is decadent as traditional tiramisu, yet it only has 83 calories per piece and less than one gram of saturated fat. To get this recipe, as well as lots of other lighter ones, all you have to do is go to our website and type in lighter tiramisu. I'm Howard in the Mr. Food Test Kitchen, where today we found a skinnier way for you to say, ooh, it's so good. Courtney's Look brought to you by Salon Allure Salon and Day Spa, located in Williamsville. And we would like to also share something very special with you this morning. Court, we have a family four-pack of vouchers for the upcoming Harlem Globetrotters show, which is tonight at the, uh, the Key Center, okay? Now, the vouchers you get, you will redeem them for tickets at the box office. So don't forget to get there a few minutes early so you can go ahead and do that. But this is nearly a $100 value, these four vouchers. So if you would like to win them, you know the drill. It's caller 7 to 644-9840. And uh, listen, if you haven't won anything from us in the last 90 days, you could be the winner, okay? So call her 7 to 644-9840. Court, our show here is going to be opening at about 11 o'clock. Today, the hours are, I think, until about um, 10 o'clock tonight. And then for the weekend, Saturday, 10 to 10, and Sunday from 10 to 7. So there's a lot to show everybody. Yeah, and it sounds like there's a lot going on this weekend here in Western New York. Mm -hmm. And those times... That's a lot of hours to pick out the perfect vehicle for you to take home. Uh, the other day I spent some time browsing around and trying to find my vehicle that and I could look good in all of, of them. Well, I always <laughs> like to find the vehicle that matches my outfit. So today maybe I'll go for a black Camaro oh, or something. Why not? I know, why not? I know. Great. Well, as you can see, take a look. I've been browsing around and maybe you'll find your perfect vehicle. Can you believe there are more than 200 vehicles to choose from here at the Buffalo Auto Show? From pickup trucks to hot rods to SUVs, I don't even know where to begin. There are two floors of fantastic salt-free vehicles, may I add. So let's go and check them out. And look at what we have here. Check out the 2018 Honda Civic Touring. Can't get enough of the color. That's, of course, what caught my attention with this vehicle is the beautiful candy apple red. It's traditional. It's a beautiful pop of color. And it makes me just want to take this car home right now. I could drive myself out of the, uh, the Buffalo Auto Show for sure. But we're just getting started here. There's so many other vehicles to look at. And instead of um, choosing a Honda Civic, I think I would like to look at a vehicle that I can take my entire family around Western New York. So let's see what they have to offer. Now check out this ride. It looks like I can bring my entire family and all of my friends as we travel around Western New York. Where do you want to go here on AM Buffalo? We'll take you there with the 2018 Airstream Tommy Bahama edition. Now with Tommy Bahama, I'm thinking maybe we can head somewhere down south where it's nice and warm. And as you can see, this truly is a luxurious vehicle. You can call this vehicle home for at least a week, maybe even even a, a few weeks as you travel around Western New York. And there's so much more to look at here at the Buffalo Auto Show. What will we find next? Look what we found. It is the 2018 WRX Subaru. So this is the limited edition. What I love most about this vehicle, first, I will add the, the color. It's just beautiful. It's unique. It's different. And driving around the area, you're going to be noticed in this car. But also, especially during the weather conditions this time of year, the roads can be slick. They can be snowy. And it's cold, which means you may experience a little black ice. This vehicle is perfect in those conditions because it's all-wheel drive so anywhere you're traveling around western new york you will feel safe and comfortable in this subaru well it looks like we are going off-roading here on am buffalo if you're looking for an adventure for sure you must purchase the brand new sport jeep wrangler now this car is perfect for